There we go. Working on that, forgot to turn it off. It's supposed to hit up to 70 degrees today, don't need a heater. Well, I ain't gonna be going up the Scott Trail for a while till the water come and goes down. So this is just kind of a goof off day. Tool around to see what's going on up here. My buddy Ralph is up ahead. He's got his dogs with him. I talked about that new battery setup on I got on the GoPro with the battery pack in my pocket wired into it. And I've been real happy with that. That last ride I was out all day. And I would have gone through about four or five batteries. But the battery pack uh, lasted all day and didn't even go down one notch. You know, it was like a half a, a notch down. So, that worked real good. And I'm gonna be, keep on using that. But just for caution's sake, I keep a couple spare batteries in my pocket. It's pretty in here today. But after all that, I went through on that last ride and walk. I was pretty wore out for a couple of days. So it's good. Maybe it's a good thing it did start raining again. Well, there's Ralph up ahead of me, running the dogs. He's got some really cool dogs. I've known them since they were pups. And now they've got really big, and they don't know how big they are. They like to jump on you and play. You going up top of the world? Uh, no, I, just, I don't know where I'm going to go. I didn't ever go to the lake. Okay, I'm going to run up top of the world. Then, uh, your way. You probably go faster than I do. Yep. Okay, see you later. Sometimes the voice commands on this thing uh, decide it doesn't want to work. So every now and then you got to check. Oh, it's pretty in here. Getting brushy though, but 
gonna have to do a little cleaning one of these days. Before it gets totally brushed in. got a little water in here this time. Last time I was through it was bone dry. Forget what they call them red berries. They're, they're not salmon berries, they're some kind of other thing they grow on the trees and everything. Then in the fall, they start to ferment. And all the birds get drunk on them. You can see birds flopping around on the ground having a good time. out on the top. Yeah, the river ain't up that much. And not too much ice down on the outflow there. I was expecting to see more of it. Unless it blew in the other end of the lake. Well, 
turn around and There's a little closer up of them berries. Can't remember the name of them. I hear they're on a small bush, that, but the, these grow up in trees too. They're, I got them in front of my house, they get pretty bit big. They're not good for us to eat, but the birds like them when they're fermenting. Got some chickens there. Boy, they get in the brush and they just disappear. Okay, back into the woods. drying up a little bit in here. This is uh, usually gets pretty muddy when it gets raining. So except for the holes, it's not bad. Well, up over the rock pile. Buddy of mine was going up there a week or so back and doesn't have much experience on a wheeler. Flipped over backwards. He was a little bruised up, but uh, that was it. Didn't damage the machine. Ralph's ahead of me, I can see his wet tracks on the rocks. See how much water we got here. Well, it's a little up, not bad. Still going to pick my feet up. Yeah, just barely over the floorboard, another few spots.
the lake was up, but it's going down. I'll take the go around here. Looks like a lot of stuff drifted out since the last time I was in here. There's Ralph. Where's he at now? Ah, he's probably hiking along. Lots of driftwood. I ain't going any further in here. That's his raft or somebody else's. There's some big stuff drifted in over there. Ralph's probably walking up there. He's got a camp up around the bend there. He's probably checking that out. Boy, the sun is bright.